Hi folks, another version of uh, How to Take Things Apart by Joe Scrapper. Today we're going to take these things apart. They're fairly simple. There's not much to them. A lot of plastic, okay, but there's a lot of wire on here too. So what we're going to do is we're going to start chipping away at this thing and make this into clean copper number two. All right, there's a little ring right around here that happens to be a stainless steel thing. So first thing I do is I take and with the edge of my hammer, by the way, folks, I use this here to take apart all of my scrap, every bit of it, this hammer right here, all right? It's a mason hammer, but it's got this chisel thing on the end, okay? I've explained this before in other videos, but you must have one of these if you want to be productive taking apart scrap. This is the only hammer. This hammer here, see the claws on it right there? Okay, those get caught on everything. So this hammer here is useless except for smashing and bashing. This one here, chipping away at stuff. All right, so with that being said, we've got that stainless steel off of here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to stand it up on the side, and I use the side of my hammer this way instead of this way so I don't rack myself with on my hand. Okay? All right, now I've gotten these two that are wrapped around this. Um, I don't know what it is, but it's got, it sticks to the the uh, magnet, so it's got to have some steel in it. So I don't know what it is, but that's what they have in there. All right. Now this here has all been wrapped around here. I'm going to have to smash this one again. There's several kinds of these. This one here happens to be fairly difficult because it's all the windings. All right. With that being said, you pull all, all these little wires out of here. They're all kind of looped around. All right. And once you get that out, there's some clean copper right there. Number two clean copper. Now I could do the other side, but let's get on to the next one. This one over here is a little bit easier because it doesn't have it braided around the plastic. All right. And that should come apart. Now you've got these two here. Make sure you get your little PC board off of there. Throw that in your um, bailing tin. Here is clean copper number two. Throw that in your bucket. Now these things here are fairly easy to do if you spend time with it. Are you aiming straight at me? Yes. Okay. All right, now you smash them with your hammer. And what I like to do is use the corner of my hammer. Even if you have one of these, just use the edge right there and smash it at an angle. It will chip it easier than hitting it flat. It will scatter it in better pieces, okay? Trust me. See, like that, where you smash straight down, all it does is make it into a pot. So hit it with the corner. Now, over the top of a bucket, you do this to it. You see how I'm flinging this all out? And look at how it's just dropping away. It's so easy to do. Some of them have glue on them, so they become a little bit more difficult. But that's how you take apart these, uh, what people call yoke, but I call it a crown, because it's got gold, uh, brass on it. Uh, not brass, but copper. Um, let's do another small one here. Just so you get the idea. There's your stainless steel. You put it in your stainless steel pile. Now, smash it. You got this piece of copper, that piece of copper. Those are clean. And then you come in here and do that again. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to take apart those crowns. My name is Joe Scrapper. Thank you for watching.